I'm curious if the issue of this lack of reporting also um, conforms to these uh, polling numbers I want to share with you. Uh, and this comes uh, on the issue of, of, of Asian American hate. Um, 10 percent over the last year have experienced hate crimes or incidents so far. 31 percent of Asian Americans worry about being hate crime victims. Um, 30 percent would be very comfortable reporting the hate crime. And it's that last one I want to talk to you about. Because of that, of the other groups measured, Asian Americans were the least comfortable reporting hate crimes. That, 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 is, that was the biggest takeaway, that there was a lot of, of, of nervousness in the community for reporting a hate crime. How do you change that? We need to send the message out to all our Asian American community that it's important for them to report these hate crimes that it is safe, that it is confidential, and that, in fact, they can get resources from the entities like the Stop API Hate website, uh, which has taken it under his w its wing. And, in fact, there are 3,800 hate crimes and incidents that have been reported since the coronavirus first started. So that is just the tip of the iceberg. But we know that there is underreporting going on because of the fear that our Asian American community has. Yeah. Nonetheless, I want to send the message out there to everybody that they need to report it and they will feel certainly less isolated if they do so. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.